Tonight, an arrest a family has been waiting for for months. In January, the body of 17 year old Jalen Jones was found behind a small community of homes in Germantown. That was four months ago. Today, Montgomery County Police say they've made an arrest. Colby Satterfield is live there now with the details that we are just learning. So what do we know, Colby? Leslie, we just learned from authorities that a 70 year old student who was a classmate of Jalen Jones is facing first degree murder charges and right now is being held without bond. Montgomery County police are attributing DNA found at the scene to Taquan Dion Henderson. Police say Jalen Jones left his house Friday, January 21st alone to meet someone named Tay and never came back. His body was found three days later in a creek in Germantown. An autopsy found the teen died from blunt and sharp force injuries at the same place his body was discovered. Police say they found boots and jeans with blood evidence on them. That DNA was determined to be Taquan Henderson's. At this point, police say the two boys did have a relationship, but at this point they say they cannot elaborate further. Police tell me they also have reason to believe that there may be more than one suspect and at this time are asking anyone who has any information, whether it be students or whether it be parents, to please contact them. As for Jalen Jones's mother, we have been hearing for her pleading for justice. I just spoke with her a few minutes ago and she tells me at this time she is hopeful that justice will prevail right now. Um, her son's accused killer is being held without bond. I'm live in Montgomery County, Colby Satterfield, WUSA 9. Yeah, so the investigators are staying on top of this. Colby, thank you.